Fuck. Desk, messy like usual. Face, cute like usual. Uh, we got everything in check. Let's go. Time to make a YouTube video. Oh, you know what I really want? I want a... I want a Hotties Wireless. Uh, two months ago, I made my video about the Hotties Wireless. No, two months is a long time. And pretty much, I don't have my Hotties Wireless yet. I'm pretty angry about it. So what we're going to do today is we're going to go in the jungle, in the wilderness, and we're going to go find a Hotties Wireless. Let's go. So I'm out here in the jungle looking for a Hotties Wireless real quick. Oh! Oh, shit. Uh, that's a Hotties Wireless. That's a very inconvenient spot for it to spawn, but it's in its natural habitat, so... So first what you want to do is creep up on it and uh this is a lot more stupid than i thought uh whatever oh okay we got it now i have to figure out how i'm gonna connect it all right so i'm back from the jungle uh i got my hottest wireless so uh I, I it didn't come with the antenna but i found this uh radar thing that my grandpa left around from world war ii the stupid. dryer is done okay um the dryer is done. Pretty much got my hottest wireless. Uh, I'm actually like, I was kind of angry that I had to wait for that long, but I also kind of understood that they didn't really like stipulate when they deliver this. Uh, it was a pre-production sample, so sample. And the copies that people were getting in the beginning, they were actually kind of defective. So I'm kind of glad that I got a good one. This is my first wireless ultralight mouse and I am extremely happy with it. This is very nice. Uh, it kind of cramped my fingers at first. I haven't used it that much, you know, like literally got it just yesterday. Let's check the battery life. Okay, it came it came at like 95%. No, I got it for two days. I thought I had one day. Okay, okay, well that's because I've been sitting at home all day, not doing online classes because, you know, I have to get excused because I might have COVID. Uh, other than that, this is pretty good mouse. Ah, this is, okay, so GMA Ponos. This comes with GMA Ponos. Uh, I've only ever used Omrons and TTC Golds in my life, and honestly, I like the TTC Golds more. This just feels like a heavier uh, Omron. It, yeah, it's more tactile, but the sound the sound isn't really satisfying. And if I were like soldering new mouse switches, I would definitely solder in TTC Golds because those sound really good and crisp. This just sounds like like dull and heavy and like. Yeah, maybe you like that sound, but my personal opinion, I, I would also solder in a mouse switch, not for the performance, but the sound as well. The shape, this is, I thought it would be as thick as an MN710, but it's actually thinner. Like, I was not expecting it to be this thin. It's a pretty nice mouse. Look, look, watch this, watch this durability test. I'm giving this mouse childhood trauma, and it's still surviving. So that's really impressive. I'm not going to plug it in at all, of course, because I have to do a full review on it. But yeah, just initial impressions. Pretty good mouse. Been playing pretty well with it. Uh, it's not my favorite shape in the world, but it's wireless and ultralight. What else can I ask for? Thanks for watching. I'm gonna probably Twitch stream after this, so links in the description. Go follow my Twitter. It's in the description. Discord in the description. Subscribe. Use code NerdyPV at checkout for WPRCodes.com. Bye.